I found out through word of mouth, um, I knew someone who worked at Lincoln City Council as about doing apprenticeships and working in partnership with Lincolnshire County Council, so it seemed a really good opportunity, so that's how I found out. Um, I applied through the Lincolnshire County Council website and also got a lot of information from friends who have done it in the past. Fresh new ideas in um, with usually young people and not necessarily um, with without really any bad habits employment wise or anything like that and you can really mould them into the employee that you want them to be. The um, events that have um, work as part of the whole team doing sort of normal everyday tasks, um, learning skills and experiences that you know is going to help them going forward. Um, they've also helped the team that are down there um, because they're, they're starting to develop sort of mentoring skills. Uh, I actually originally planned to go to university, uh, it wasn't for me though, so then I went into full time work uh, in sport but then I thought oh, I sort of wanted to do both, obviously getting a qualification I'm working so that's why apprenticeships work for me. Um, I wasn't sure what kind of course or what university I wanted to go to so I thought I'd rather go into full time education and uh, get a qualification and employability skills at the same time. Well, I found that um, you were learning on the job and then picking up skills and knowledge about the organisation and, and things I think you wouldn't find at university where you gain the knowledge and you build relationships with people and it, yeah I think it worked better for me for my own learning needs. So it very much is an investment as a service or an organisation into future employees. It's between they get lots of experiences um, and it's real life experiences that they can use for their MVQ so we don't actually um, make things up to fit the MVQ. Um, well I'm currently working to my MVQ level 2 um, also I think with working for the council I'm a lot more involved in sort of helping out the community um, so you're sort of giving something back so to speak. Managed to progress up career grades and um, I think that really helped starting sort of from the bottom and finding out about the organisation and skills and knowledge, I think that was really useful. Real life skills, um, employability skills, so we've been in the forefront of it all and we can say that we've had these experiences whereas other people who've just come from education can't say that they've had the hands on experience that we have. We've got quite a lot of apprentices across the whole service doing a wide range of different, different activities. Um, so it's been quite easy to integrate them um, and find tasks for them to do. Look into apprenticeship roles because they're expanding all the different frameworks and there's so many different apprenticeships out there for people. It's definitely a very good opportunity. It's definitely something to think about if you are interested in obviously uh, earning and learning so to speak. Well I'm not in debt, <laughs> which is a good one. Um, hands on experience and definitely the relations with people, understand the organisation which I think is really key for when you're wanting to progress your career and looking at the different sort of service areas. It's a great idea for you to be able to get that qualification but also be able to earn money and get the experience of working with it hands on. It is very much an investment, it's very rewarding as well as a manager um, to see people develop and progress from you know, I've had apprentices that walked in and they didn't even know how to send an email or whatever that are now doing all sorts of brilliant work. So. I would definitely say, you know, go for it. Um, I think we've got a lot to learn from them but we've, we're also, you know, promoting the workforce of the future um, and developing them to move on to, you know, permanent roles within the council.